race six uh, then, and so uh, we've got full field of 14 to go around here in the sixth event, which is a class four. We're back to the 1,000 metres, down the straight again for the second time on Sunday. The field headed by Cordyceps Six, who sprung a massive surprise in Griffin Company over course and distance back in May. Fabulous eight down in class, good course and distance record for him. The debutants, East Sprinter, Kowloon East Star, and Nervous Witness, G1 Excellent. Uh, a couple of starts for him last season. Lexi Vidal rides from barrier number 13. We've got Baltic Whisper, who's a four-time course and distance winner, so awesome, Goodmanship, and who loves the ace for Casper Fowns and Karis Teton, who's yet to place in five starts so far. Again, the pace should be pretty solid, you think, uh, Mark, over the thousand? It uh, will indeed, Andrew, and nervous witness. There's quite a boom on this horse. He's come up with a very short-priced favourite. Kowloon East Star, one of the other first starters, goes with him. Line of four, Glenelg General's good spot from barrier 14. Fabulous eight, who's won first up in the past, who loves the ace, quarter step six. Another line of four, a line of three, back to spicy, so good. And uh, Wonderful Fantasy is last, but Nervous Witness will be the one everyone's watching. Certainly favourite punters in race six. All right, we'll come back to him in a second. He's uh, two's on favourite at this stage. First up, though, Paul, we'll have a look at uh, Circuit 7 and Spicy So Good. We're going back um, to June of uh, last season. Lucky Quality was the winner of that uh, race. But what do you think of their chances? Yeah, I, I, I quite like Spicy So Good, actually. I managed to put him in the, in the numbers here. Uh, I thought it was a good run from him. He's definitely on the approved Joe Marrera uh, aboard. So, uh, look, he definitely goes in for me. Got him in also. He has had some internal issues. He's had blood in the track. He had two out of the four starts. But when he did not that time, showed that he does have some ability. All right, let's go to the favourite, Nervous Witness, uh, trained by David Hayes. As Mark said, bit of a boom on this horse. Let's learn a little bit more about him. Race number six, Nervous Witness. You've been pretty patient with him. Couple of trials last season, not quite ready to make his race debut. I just was decided to save him for this year. Uh, you know, it was right in, he arrived in the real hot period of Hong Kong. So we just took our time. He, he trialled very well last season and, and his trial this season, I thought was pretty encouraging. Pricked the ears over the line and Zach was happy with the trial too? Yeah, he was, he was. Um, and he was good through the line. So. Um, he'll be one of the favourites and hard to beat. It looks like he's got natural early speed too. He headed off Noir Ryder, who's no slouch out of the gates in that trial. Yeah, probably if he's got a weakness, a bit like Super Axion, he gets on with it a bit. Um, and we've been trying to harness that the whole time he's been in Hong Kong. And if he can come back 10%, I'm pretty confident he'll go th through the grades pretty quickly. All right, some Positive words then, Mark, uh, from, the, from the train. He does have a, a lovely, easy way of going about him as well, doesn't he? The he yeah, pricked the ears on the line and heard from Dave that he ran through it too. Paul showed speed and even if he does get a bit keen, a thousand metres down the straight, he might be able to get away with it at his first start. Yeah, look, he tried really well in Australia before he came here. He's come here now. His trials have all been first class and he, he looks a really nice recruit here in Hong Kong. So he's going to be short, but he's going to take a world of beating. Yeah, carrying those those colours as well of, of silent witness. It makes any difference to him, but it does sort of uh, just make you think a little bit as well, doesn't it? He does look the business, but he needs to do on the track as well. G1 excellent we'll look at now, Paul. He's trialling up at uh, Chung Fra. I thought there was a little bit in this. Yeah, I thought it was a nice trial. He seems to have improved. He's only had the two starts today. He's drawn nicely in barrier number 13. Alexi Vidal will take them out. So, look, he, he was right. Another one that was on the cusp didn't quite make it, but it was a nice trial, definitely eye-catching. Yeah, found a spot for him also. I don't think he beat a whole lot. Country Boy hasn't set the world on fire, but this guy's only had the two starts, made good ground along the rail under a hold, so he's certainly in the top four. Yeah, um, he's had those couple of starts last season as well, so he's got a, um, a couple of runs under his belt. But two's on about this uh, first starter, Paul. What do you think? Yeah, I've got him on top. I think he's a horse who's looking really good at the moment, isn't he? Uh, nervous witness. The trials have all been good, and let's see if he can bring it on race day. Fabulous eight. Now, uh, look, we know he likes it down the straight thousand. He's drawn nice in 11. He gets a, an apprentice claim. He's won off a higher rating of 60 before. So, uh, and he goes well fresh. So I think he's the danger. The Calhoun East Star is another first starter. Now, he's trolled over 800 metres. One of his trolls over 800 metres. He did beat Trillion Wynn, who's uh, come out and done really well in Hong Kong last season. And uh, Spicy so good. We saw that re replay earlier on. So six, two, five and three. With the favourite, impossible not to be on his trial, Nervous Witness. He did it well in Australia and he's carried it on here into Hong Kong. Three trials and one this time in nine. Glenelg Generals. Now, he has won first up in the past. He's drawn 14. And we saw on the speed map he's going to be right behind the favourite. 1,000 metres is perfect for him. Spicy so good. And G1 Excellent from Barrier 13 will be up 
in behind them too towards the end of the race. Six, nine, three and eight, race number six. I think Nervous Witness is going to take the world of beating, but because he's so short, it creates value um, elsewhere. And at that sort of price, G1 excellent, 5.1 a place, might attract some interest from me as well. It's a good looking sixth event though. Class four, over the thousand metres.